Hi there everyone, it's Sarah here. I hope you're having a great weekend. It's been a long time since I've made a video, but uh, I'm here today to share with you all my design team kit that I've been sent for being part of the Colourcraft design team. Um, Colourcraft are a company based in the UK and you may be more familiar with the name Brusho, but they manufacture brushos and they also do a whole host of other colours and adhesives and mediums and you know, you name it, they more or less have it. So this is my latest design team kit. I've already had one and I've been on the design team now for about three or four months, since about April, and I've created quite a few projects for them and they have a design team blog, so if you're interested in having a look at what they make in the design team and what we're all up to, I will insert a, a you know a little link up here so that you can click on it and get taken straight to it. Um, so without further ado, I will. This is my box of goodies that I've been sent. I've already opened it and I've had a peek inside, but what I'll do is I'll take this out and I'll share it with you. So let me just set this to the side for the moment. Okay, so first up. I have a fabric paint introduction pack and there are eight different colours in here. You're getting lemon yellow, golden yellow, scarlet, magenta, leaf green, violet, cyan and turquoise. You can see that there and that's the paints. They look fabulous actually. I've not opened them yet but what I'll do is following this video I will open everything up properly and do colour swatches um, and do swatches of the fabric paints actually on fabric. Let's have a look at this green one. So you're getting a good size little pot. Um, there's 28 mils in here and this is the opaques. And let's have a little look. Oh wow, they look great. So the fab, the, the colour is so vibrant be good to see what they look like on on actual fabric so I will give these a little test out and by the looks of it you get instructions with them as well so what I'll do is I'll go through all this when I do the swatches and I'll read out all the bits and bobs that has actually come along with this because it's saying that they're permanent, soft to handle, multi-purpose, simple to use, um, etc, etc. So that is the opaques and I've also been sent an 8 pack which is the introduction pack of the metallics. So you're getting gold, silver, copper, bronze, cosmic blue, shimmer, Pink, oh, is that a shimmer? Blue shimmer, pink, regal, purple, and aquamarine. And these look fabulous as well. And again, I'll do another video. I'll try and do little short ones so that, you know, I'll do one on the, the opaques, one on the metallics, and so on and so forth. So that's the metallics. And then I've also got the fabric paint mixer set and you're getting a black, a white, a mid grey and an extender base. And again, instructions in the back and these look fab too. So they're all 20, little 28ml pots. And I've also got a big pot of Expand It. Now, this is it provides dimensional effect on card, paper and fabric by expanding when heat cured. So this will be interesting to put this through a stencil and then heat it up and then apply fabric paints and so on and so forth. So I'll probably do a little video tutorial on this as well once I get to grips with it and, you know, have a play around with it and see what it actually, you know, what it, what it can do. Um, I also got a little pack of pipettes which will come in handy for when I do this. Now this is Procyon and it is a, a dye starter pack and this is for dyeing fabrics so this is going to be fab. 
because I've got just a little project in mind to use this with and you're actually getting the the fixer as well so you know I'll I'll do a separate video opening this one up detailing everything that's in it um, but this is just a quick share at the moment just to let you see what I got okay so the next thing we got is Aztec metallic craft paint and this is the Peril and it's a massive bottle Hang on. there you go and again it's water-based non-toxic it's intermixable with brusho and um, you can use it on paper card, bond web wallpaper, unglazed clay, terracotta, well most surfaces so that's pretty, a nice big bottle of pearl craft paint okay and the next thing we've got two things left and I'll get rid of this box out of the way are they do brushel acrylic mist sprays they do a mist one and a shimmer so I've got the first one is the mist spray and it is a set of six and this is lemon scarlet sea green charcoal that'll be an interesting one violet and turquoise so again, I'm going to swatch all these in a separate video just to let you see the colours. But I'm really looking forward to using these. How exciting. It'll be great for mixed media journals, art journal pages. You name it. Okay, so that was that. And then we've got the metallic shimmer spray set. Well, it's a shimmer. It's not metallic. but You've got the, the pigment in the bottom, the mica powder in the bottom and just give it a swirl there's ball bearings on the bottom of this just to help with the mixing and that is amazing, can you see that colour? just dispersing through there so this is the Shimmer Violet let me pick a light one so you can see this is Shimmer Gold you can see the mica in the bottom, let's give this a mix look at that That's fabulous. Um, so we've also got a Shimmer Bronze. Lovely. And Silver. It's, yeah, sh a sh Shimmer Silver. How good does that look? I love the movement of the colour. Um, turquoise. And again, that's a turquoise one. I'm getting a bit of a glare off my window. see that one and the last one is shimmer copper fabulous colors so that's my latest design team kit loads and loads of goodies to play with um, and also in the kit was Two packets of Tyvek, and that's that. Um, it's heavyweight paper that's you, you can't really rip it, so it'd be good for stitching and what have you. And also, we got a packet of Lutrador, medium weight. So I haven't worked with Lutrador before, but what it's saying is it's a semi-transparent, non-woven polyester that can be coloured using paints, transfer dyes, fabric paints pens, pencils, anything at all. Use it in textile or paper arts when you need a stable yet transparent fabric that won't fray 
that can be stitched through distressed with a soldering iron or heat gun and it's available in three weights. You can get it in a lightweight, medium weight and heavy weight. Um, and this one here is 70 and it's the medium weight. So this is Luchador. I'm looking forward to having a play with that. Okay, so that's my design team kit. Um, I hope you'll come back to my channel and have a little look and see at the colour swatches once I get organised and get these done. Hopefully I should get it done this weekend and uh, I'm really looking forward to having a play around with all this lot. I'm excited. Okay then, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you all soon with projects if you fancy joining us across on the Colour Craft blog. And again, I'll leave the link up here and uh, you can pop along and see what we're up to. Thanks again. Bye for now.